Let's look at the harmonic output. Hey folks, and thanks for joining me. Happy spring to everyone out there. Hope everyone's doing well. While I was waiting on the weather to improve, I uh, knocked out a couple more little projects here that I kind of worked on during the winter months. One of them, this first one, being an electronic electroscope. And I'm using this to identify the uh, outside foil of a capacitor. So I know there's a lot of theories on that. You've got your modern day caps and of course the old caps that have a bigger uh, form factor and can definitely, uh, if inserted wrong, can allow uh, ingress back into the receiver. So the electronic electroscope circuit resides on this side here, just using a, a JFET. And then I'm using an LM386 to generate a uh, carrier, square wave carrier, very rich in harmonics as you saw, uh, just north of uh, 1000 hertz. I've already identified the outside foil on numerous capacitors here and I uh, have them marked in green. Let's get this inserted here and I'll show you how it works. We'll flip it on here. And I'm generating that tone here across the uh, capacitor itself and the receiver attached to the uh, clamp around the uh, capacitor itself to uh, sniff out the uh, signal. So we're measuring the uh, current flow and the end of the capacitor that has the highest amount of current flowing, if I can flip the switch here, would indicate the outside foil. So the outside foil for this particular capacitor resides on this side, is indicated by the direction of the double pole, double throw switch, and the meter reading itself here. Of course, you don't have to use a standalone amp meter, DC amp meter, like I'm using here. You could just use a standard um, digital voltmeter that has a, a DC current uh, capabilities. That's how simple the uh, circuit is, and it works pretty well. I think the secret sauce, again, being the electronic electroscope is extremely sensitive. As you can see here, if I just touch the uh, clip here with the uh, lead pencil, you can see the current increase as well as my finger. And it does a pretty good job, even on the low value capacitors, to be able to um, identify the uh, outside foil. I'll place the uh, schematic on my uh, Google Drive and put a link there in the video description or show more of the uh, video if you're interested in uh, building this circuit for yourself. I've got another little cool project too that I'll be sharing uh, probably in the next uh, week, maybe sooner. It's a, a Q multiplier for your little transistor radios to kind of beef up the uh, reception, so stay tuned for that video as well. Thanks again for watching.